Hey guys, Anna Lee here. Today I'm going to give you my bedroom tour. Um, well, not like a full out one, but like my animals in it. You know, if you know what I mean. And all my supplies and stuff I use for them. So I just, so I am moving my animal then. I, I started doing that. Um, I'm going to get more animals in here. I plan on doing that. I only have a fish and a hamster right now. But I'm going to show you like what I do with them during the night and all that. So, sorry. so first over here I have my hamster Lila. I have her information written up here. Lila, her birthday is February 18th, 2020. How do I know that? I do because we bred them. Um, I have a hamster named Rosie. She was one of the babies. She's grown up now. There she is. She's awake. Seems like she's awake. Okay, she's asleep. I do plan on getting her actually I do plan on getting her some sort of light. I know it's pretty bad for them, but like I'm gonna see if it makes her be quiet. I'm just, just gonna be experiment. I have one on my desk right here for the fish. <laughs> she thinks she likes it, but anyway. Um I'm just gonna just be a small small experiment experiment. I'm gonna see if she's see if she makes her be quiet down a little bit at night. I do plan on getting her silent spinner, but her wheels are really loud though. Really loud, so most of the time I do move her downstairs at night. But I wonder if the light will help you help you be quiet. Yeah, I wonder. She does like the light actually. She's very weird. She's usually awake during all day. Sometimes she's sleeping though. That's her little thing. She sleeps here. This green hut under the wheel. And over there, um, and up here, up the, well, she doesn't sleep up there, she has all her food up there. So, funny story, um, I was actually gonna get her a bigger cage, because this cage was too tiny, because we had attached to a different cage, but, um, that cage, she shared with her mother, and then they started to fight, and getting really big fights, and started getting to the point where it was dangerous, so we had to detach the cage, and so this is the only cage we had, we had. Her mother has a tinier one. We had two really tiny cages attached. This one and the other one. So, I was going to get her a bigger cage, but she loves this cage. She didn't want a bigger cage. She was sad. So, we so we had to put her back in this cage. And, yeah. So, I was actually very confused why she was so happy. But, I'm going to get... So, I'm going to try to add some more on. But, I feel like she's just perfectly fine in here. It's a very odd circumstance. But I, we usually have b b really big cage for hamsters. The first time I've actually um, did this, and this is my uh, hamsty hamsty with a baby, but yeah. So over here is my fish army. As I said, we have not got before her. I had this before I got her actually, but she likes it, so I put over her thing, turn it on like this, and then she likes it better with the lights on. So I have the light on then, because it's wasting energy. Oh, I'm filming, but yeah. I'm gonna, I might move. I might actually keep that on at night for now. I want to see if it does they do any noise, but it should probably still be awake with the wheel might not be as big as a problem. So I'm gonna turn it off. It's just for special occasions. But okay, I have more over here. So in here, I keep their food in this um, little basket. Thing. I have their sunburst, their favorite foods, like sunflower seed, I mean, not their favorite food, like the hamsters. I have more hamsters so you didn't know. I have a pet room video somewhere. And I have hair food right here. I feed her the Emmy beta food, this beta food. So when they have store. Yeah. Favorite food. Lila. Okay. So yeah, there's sunburst. Yeah, that's her favorite. Favorite are the um, sunflower seeds, these brown chunks, and the pumpkin seeds. So yeah, I'll show you my my I'll show you my, my favorite furniture I have for both of them. 
So, my probably my all-time favorite piece of furniture in Lyle's cage is probably, well, not like all-time, but actually, she really likes that blue thing. It's um, a food. It's not exactly a furniture. She also, I also like this hut. The green one, I think, is the better one because it, I think, I feel like they feel more natural in there. In their natural habitat. I feel like the clear one is just a little too much, not like a hut. And then over here, I have... Oh yeah, I forgot to show you. Um, I have Aunt Emmy's. I I thought I thought this might be her birthday, but I had no idea. This is their. They they get them when they're like kind of babies, kind of not. So I got her in two thousand eighteen. Actually, she's been living for a long time. And um, so I guess it was around there because I got her in like May. No, I I got her in May. May no, I didn't. I got her in two thousand nineteen. So I I was guessing it was like around. I got her around that time, so I was guessing her, it was like December 15th, 2018, got her when I was in third grade, which was like, which was like two years ago, yeah, it was for a really long time, right, right, ooh, that's a really good shot, so, here it goes, okay, anyway, Wait, let's show you one more thing over here. My, she, I don't really like that leaf. She never uses it. That log is her favorite thing that, her, that I use for her, though. She sleeps in there sometimes. Yeah, so that's basically... So that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, Subscribe and hit the notification bell and like this video. Thank you. Bye.